Hi guys, and welcome to here. Welcome to yet another video. Today we're going to be adding some tools to the game. So the first thing that we want to do is we're going to actually add a comment because every tool has a tool material, which is basically like all the stats about it. So if you do slash slash, this means it's a comment tool materials, and it's just going to say where all the tool materials are. So public static tool material you can press control space to finish it off and I'm going to call this copper copper underscore mat actually copper material and it equals to enum helper dot add tool material now this, this has got quite a few stuff now uh, the name can just be the name of the tool material so as it's going to be copper now I've actually got this Word document linked in the description for download. This is going to help us fill in these. So, as you can see, these are the default harvest levels. So, I think ours is going to be like the same as iron. So, harvest level, I'm going to put it as two. Now, max uses, so like the durability. So, diamond has 1561, iron's 250. I'm going to make this one 300. Efficiency. So this is the mining speed. So this is the normal mining speed. So we want ours to be like not as good as iron. So I'm going to say about 5.0 f. So 5.0 f. Damage. So this is damage versus entities. As you can see, swords add different ones so damage so I think ours is going to be the same so 2.0 and finally enchantability so this is like how it just determines like how when you enchant like what enchants you get so gold is 22 iron is 14 ours is going to have 12 so we've added that all material now we're actually going to go and make a new package this is going to be for items because we like with a block we can't use this here this new item you actually have to make your own so in here you want to add a new class and we're going to call it item mod pickaxe going to create another class item mod axe create another class item mod ho another class item mod shovel and yet another class item mod sword so all you have to do for these is really simple so just extends item pickaxe yep and then as to create a constructor for the tool material which you can do make sure this is public and then you actually I'm going to put the unlocalized name in with it so string unlo unlocalized name so then we can just like set it so this dot set unlocalized name unlocalized name now we can actually select this and copy it. Save that. That's all for that class. Now let's go over to my item mod axe and this extends item axe. Just control shift o to automatically import and then just paste this and change the constructor. And then all for that class. And then same again. Item ho. Control Shift O, paste, change the constructor, save, close, extends, item. Now, is it? I think it's. No, it's item spade. They use spade. I use shovel. Does it really matter? Same thing. Actually, you don't need to add that. What am I doing? Just paste it and change to constructor. It's a lot of repetition, I know. And this extends item 
sword and control B change to constructor now we can in fact save now what we can do is I'm going to add another comment here for tools and this is actually going to be all the tools so it's public static item pickaxe copper underscore pick um, public static item ho and that's copper underscore ho public static item axe copper underscore axe public static item spay copper underscore shovel shovel public static item sword copper underscore sword now we can just control shift o automatically import all of these now we just have to initialize them so i'm going to do another comment here for tools so copper underscore pick equals a new item mod pickaxe and this is co copper material and it's going to be copper underscore pickaxe and i have no idea why this opened up here now just got to, we can actually copy and paste this to make our life a lot easier so one two three four and then just go through so copper ho i don't mod ho changes to copper underscore ho axe and yeah, just import as you go axe axe shovel 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 uh, sword sword and sword for shift o to import them again that's opened up again now we can just register all of these so I keep doing comments so I can like look back on this and see everything so register item let's get a couple of these so copper pick and we can actually copy and paste this copper pick copper axe copper hoe copper shovel and copper sword and same for registering the renders register register render copper pick and we can copy and paste this again so copper pick, copper hoe, copper axe copper shovel and copper sword now this will in fact um, obviously get everything done for that so I'm going to go into my resources and I'm going to just get some textures done and that lot so I'm just going to get names done as well so I'm going to leave a gap so item dot copper underscore pickaxe dot name equals copper pickaxe you get the idea just copy and paste this a couple of times and that should be us done once we've done that now we can save this now we can close that and now we're going to get some models so back onto the word document that i made now some of the models will change so i'm actually going to copy this as you can see these these ones here in bold have changed so I'm just going to get rid of the boldness and we can just copy this from there and then what we're going to do 
is go over to models item and right click new title text file paste and as before boe colon item slash copper it's got sword now direct your way back down to where it should be which is here copper underscore sword dot jsn and then you want to do it again so now we want to go on to the other one because this one also has to change a couple of stuff so I'm going to debold it again I said debold I don't know what that's doing ok just copy and then paste yep and save and all the way back down again in model item and this is going to be copper underscore pickaxe dot gson now don't forget just to change this in here boe colon item slash copper and now we can actually copy and paste this a couple of times so control c control v and this is going to be copper underscore axe and you want to open that as well and just change this to axe and I actually want to open that with so that's pickaxe, that's the axe now we can paste it again so this is going to be copper and let's go ho and we can open this one up and change it to ho now we're going to texture these in a second, paste it again copper underscore shovel and you can open up shovel and it's going to be shovel what, what, no, no, don't save, wrong one, that one copper shovel okay so that's all the models done now we can actually texture it so go back onto your um, library thingy and get the resource pack again I love just being able to do this and it's in items so find it so I'm going to just get iron sword so let's open up this and you should get the idea on how these textures work by now so Control A, Control C, Control N. Then I like to zoom in and let's texture them. Now that's our sword, so we can actually save this now. So head over to wherever it is. Uh, oh, why am I putting in def Oh, my days. Um, put it in here. And, yep, in textures, items, copper, underscore, sword, save. Okay, and then let's open up all the others. So that's a sh shovel, pickaxe. I'm pressing control to do this. Shovel, pickaxe, uh, axe, hoe, and that should be it. So press enter. That'll just open the portals. Then we can, in fact, close these. Control A, control C, control N again. And let's get texture in. now that should be it so we can close this and now if we just refresh so right click 
refresh I should update everything and look at textures items and we have all of them so we can actually run the game now and everything should work perfectly fingers crossed okay so the game is loaded so we have no errors in chat and you can see that it did in fact register it yep so everything's going good so far um you shouldn't worry about that that's me trying to do a different tutorial and i really messed that up um yep get rid of diamonds so it yes yeah, so we actually have our copper sword here yep and it doesn't do blocks i don't know where the, the other ones will in fact be in tools so copper pickaxe copper axe copper shovel and copper hoe now just to prove that these all work we can actually get some dirt and test out the hoe and you see it works yep and um, we can try it out in survival so game mode S and everything should be good that's lovely speed and um, then obviously this will mine and like wood would work and if I summon a creeper oh it's unpeaceful um, summon a pig and we can kill the pig and it works so that is all for today's tutorial hope you enjoyed Love seeing you next. So, yeah, goodbye.